So what's the BDD Foundation all about? Well, obviously we were about uh, body dysmorphic disorder, um, but I want to try and get across the fact that we, we're a group of people who really recognise that BDD can cause a huge amount of distress and interferes very, very greatly in people's lives. Um, and of course, many of the people here know that, um, I'm sure all the people here know that, but the key thing is we want to get that message out there to the wider world and kind of get BDD to be as well recognised as OCD at least and hopefully stop people saying they're a little bit BDD, um, but recognise that actually that BDD is a very serious and distressing problem. We also appreciate that it has a great impact on the people that care for people with BDD, the, the family members, the friends, the partners. And we, we also want to get across the message that people with BDD are not vain, they're not um, self-obsessed for the fun of it, and that neither can they s suddenly stop it all and pull themselves together. We're very aware that it's very difficult to get an accurate diagnosis of BDD. We know that it's oftentimes even harder to get medical treat specialist medical treatment, get medications at the right dose, specialist psychological treatments, uh, specialist CBT. Um, but we're also very aware that many people with BDD really do want to break free from, uh, from the problem. And what they want is guidance on how to do it. And that's one of the things we're going to try and provide as a charity. Um, and we're also very aware that there's many professionals out there who are desperate to help people with BDD and they'd also like to know how to do that better. Um, so again, as a charity, we want to try and support um, those people and educate. Most importantly, if you look around, today tells you more than anything that you're not alone. Um, and we're hoping that today will be the beginning of starting a sense of community of people with BDD and the people that care and support for them. And hopefully you'll meet some people and that maybe you can share a story with and gain that little bit of extra support. And sometimes just that little bit of extra support and a little bit of extra knowing that you're not alone can be just enough for some people to push them over the edge towards really confronting their fears, cutting back on their rituals and really starting to improve on their BDD. Uh, we believe passionately that people can break free from BDD and we really hope today is going to be part of inspiring you to take action. Um, and of course, we're a charity, so we're, we are very much hoping that um, you'll support us as a charity and help us to raise funds, help us to raise awareness, help us to support research, increase the number of support groups that we're putting on or supporting, um, hoping us to respond to the media. We've been very lucky that some people have responded and helped us out with some media recently. Uh, we've had a quite a bit of interest um, over the last two or three weeks. Um, and we also are going to have to keep our main, maintaining our website and try and do our best to keep it with, updated with the best possible information. So hopefully today's a call to action to help yourselves against BDD and help us in supporting people overcoming BDD.